Good morning, my name is Rana Salzman. I'm the librarian for the American Planning Association and editor for the Kids Planning Toolbox blog. I'm here at our conference in Los Angeles and talking with Charlie Compton about his career in planning. Good morning, Charlie. Hi, good morning, Rana. <laughs> Can you start by telling me how you got interested in planning? Did you have a family member in the field? Well, my family is loaded with teachers. I'm a mother-in-law, father-in-law, my mother, a couple of daughters, and uh, many of my family members are business owners. My grandparents, my father, and both brothers. One brother's an architect, though, and growing up, I love to design things. But my designs were quite simple, uh, not very elaborate. Uh, felt like my talents matched perfectly a career in planning needing simple, workable solutions for sometimes very elaborate and complicated problems. But I'll have to credit my brother with convincing me I needed to get a degree in architecture first, then a graduate degree in planning. Okay. What does a typical day in the office look like for you? Ooh, I love to arrive at my office at least an hour before anyone else, because it's important for me to plan my day. Uh, the nice thing about being a planner is often the days are very different. Um, I may be uh, guiding this project today, but the topic the next day will be totally different. And I get to draft a lot of plans. Uh, growing up, math was my, my forte, but I uh, have learned that writing is really fun and how important it is in terms of being able to communicate what we do. Also spend a great deal of the day, obviously, setting priorities and making sure everything mm -hmm. is done within a, a, a budget. The other piece of my day, though, I always have wanted to live less than five miles from where I work. It makes it easy and uh, quickly getting to the office and that extra little advantage of, I can go home for lunch. That's true. That's always nice. Um, what do you like most about your job? What do you have the most fun doing? Ooh, I'm, I'm at my best if I'm able to help others with their concerns and their problems. Now that might be my staff members that need some help with what they're doing, but often it's members of the public who have contacted me and they have issues or problems that I can help them. And we get a great deal of enjoyment as a department helping other departments do their plans, whether it's solid waste, public safety, or public works, or whatever. Um, the most exciting thing, though, to do is the magical plans that we get to do uh, with the technologies we have now. You know, that technology that has brought us such amazing movies and, and super video games uh, and those handy apps on the internet, that same technology has given us an amazing toolbox, especially when it comes to communicating our plans to others. Sure, sure. Um, can you tell me more about where you grew up and about uh, your background? Yes, I grew up in Lexington County, South Carolina, and guess what? I've been planning director for Lexington County for 38 years. Um, there's this uh, perspective I feel like I can bring to the job by being planning director where I grew up and where I raised my family. Um, but there's also that extreme satisfaction that comes from uh, doing something really good uh, where you live. Sure, sure. And our last question, I think, is when you aren't working, what do you like to do? Ooh, that's a good one. Anything that involves uh, my family or friends. Um, probably have a preference when I have time to do things outdoors. Uh, it might be sailing with my brothers or snow skiing with my friends and daughters. Uh, sometimes a little golf. And it may seem like work to some, but I actually get some of my uh, most enjoyable time is when I'm teaching. Uh, get opportunities to teach in the local schools, uh, frequently in the university classes around, um, and often to groups of related professionals. And I would have to say that my most enjoyable time teaching, though, is when I get to meet with groups of elected officials, those people who have earned the right to make the decisions on guiding our communities. Sounds good. Well, thank you, Charlie, for taking the time to talk with us this morning, and I hope that our audience um, and blog readers enjoy hearing from you. Oh, great to be with you <laughs> this morning. Thanks.